Hi, my name is Harlan Newton from Teagle Guide Travel. Um, I was here last year for the uh, ESTM and I'm here again this year. Um, I've seen a lot of improvements both in the pre-tours that we did this year as well as just the overall organization of the, uh, of the uh, Travel Mart. Um, some of my highlights this year were uh, some of the towns that I'd never visited before, which was Suchitoto, uh, Ataco, and Isalco, and also El Tunco. Um, I'd say that um, El Salvador has a lot of potential in tourism, and I'm really glad I'm back to, uh, to experience it and to, uh, to meet with a lot of the buyers here and the, and the uh, vendors. Hi, I'm Kat Richter. I'm from Philadelphia. This is my first visit to El Salvador. I came for the press trip this week and we've had a really great time sort of crisscrossing the entire country. Uh, we keep having to stop and look at the map and figure out where we are. We've seen so much. Uh, my personal favorite was Sushi Toto. I'm an anthropologist by trade, uh, so I loved hearing about the history, the culture. We went to an indigo workshop um, run by a woman named Irma who was fantastic and took us through the process of, of how indigo uh, is made as a dye and some of the different techniques uh, and we all got souvenirs we made our own bags which we're all very proud of um, and my second favorite but part of the trip um, was Via Limon uh, up in Metapan, La Ciudad Blanca um, and we stayed in a, a very rustic cabin um, which was kind of like summer camp back to being a kid but we had fun uh, and we did a, a ropes course a zip line the canopy tour uh, our last day out traveling and that was that was a great time so thank you so much for having us greetings uh, my name is Corey Meyer and I'm representing Austin Adventures, which is a kind of all-inclusive, multi-sport uh, adventure tour company that we have tours all over the world, specializing in kind of high-end luxury tours with multiple activities, uh, hiking, biking, rafting, uh, that sort of thing. And uh, this is my first time to El Salvador, my second time to Central America, and I'm a really big fan of this place. Uh, currently, my company doesn't operate here. Uh, we are looking to branch out. Again, we got on every continent of the world. And kind of my first thoughts of coming to El Salvador uh, is it's a, it's a great place for an adventure. Uh, again, I feel like this place, it's a bit unrefined. As in, the United States by now is pretty well, like, uh, there's lots of rules and regulations and uh, it's kind of a stagnant environment in a way, whereas El Salvador has a lot of character uh, in that there's street vendors out on the street selling food and little trinkets and you, there's people riding the back of trucks and there's, you know, animals going down the road. Uh, I, I really enjoy that part, that aspect. It's very different than the culture that I live in and uh, is one of the reasons it would be great to bring people here to experience that. At the sun same time, uh, it is a bit unrefined. However, there are very classy establishments to stay at here. I was impressed uh, by the food, the restaurants, and the, uh, and the accommodations. Uh, and I think those two dynamics work really well, you know, because clients uh, from the United States, they are not used to perhaps Central America lifestyle and that sort of thing. And uh, to, to be a part of the culture and to experience all the, all the uh, stuff that goes on here uh, is great. And then to combine that with a nice accommodation, a nice uh, choice of restaurants uh, is, is great. So again, being in the travel industry, I'm just uh, excited to be here uh, in El Salvador. is a beautiful country. Uh, I was impressed by how much it has to offer uh, in in the small area you know it's not a large country and uh, overall thumbs up thanks guys hi I'm Dana Johnson I open I own a company called Open Leaf Excursions uh, I do all adventure and um, this is my first visit to El Salvador and I have to say it's an adventurous paradise uh, I traveled all over the eastern half of El Salvador the last couple of days and love how you can get lost in the nature uh, and in the water and play with the turtles and it was really fantastic and, and just what my, me and my clients love. Thank you so much.